it's another really lovely activity that you can do and spend an hour together working on. It's making a memory box. And memory boxes can be really, really important to contain the different emotions, the different memories, the different feelings that the child can be experiencing. Um, so in the mem it's really, really nice to just decorate it um, and let them put whatever they feel they need to. Um, and in that making of this box, there can be really important conversations that, that come out. And even for children who are non-verbal, just the act of getting creative and having that energy of this is why we are doing this can be really important for them. Um, so it's a memory box. Inside, you can put things like um, maybe an item of their clothing, it might be photographs of the person. Um, and with photographs, it can be really nice to make sure that they're also in the picture, particularly when working with children with Down syndrome, because they have such visual memories that when they see them in the picture with the person who has died, that they can um, really re remember that time. Maybe it's that picture of them with dad at the zoo. Um, and they remember, yeah, that's me with dad and we're at the zoo. Uh, so that, that can be really, really helpful for children with Down syndrome, not just an abstract picture of the person on their own. Um, but by all means, put as many pictures as you like. It's completely up to the individual of how they want to use these boxes as well. Uh, and then they can be put somewhere really safe and special. Uh, and then it's just nice for them to be able to know they can dip in and out of that box and add to it or take from it whenever they want to. Um, so yes, really good container for children in that way. So the other thing that we found uh, recently at the conference that's really nice to have in the house uh, from the Chartered Bereavement Network was a bowl. A bowl of maybe there's a CD in it that's got the person's favourite music on it. Maybe there's a recipe card for their favourite meal or a takeaway list for something that they always got at the Chinese. Maybe there's a jigsaw puzzle that they like to do. Anything at all, a teddy bear that they like to hold and give comfort to. Um, and this bowl can be in the house as a reminder that we talk about this person here. This person's not gone, this person's not forgotten. And at any time, somebody in the house can go to the bowl and take the CD and put on the song and have a dance to it or anything else that they find comfort from, from that bowl. <laughs>